The interstellar wanderer has returned, brighter, clearer, and more enigmatic than ever before. The James Webb Space Telescope has turned its golden eye back toward the unknown, and what it has revealed is shaking the scientific world. For the first time, humanity has captured a sharp, detailed image of the mysterious interstellar visitor known as 3E Atlas, a silent traveler drifting beyond our solar system. 3E Atlas is only the third confirmed interstellar object ever observed, following Aluamua and 2I Borisov. But unlike those faint, fleeting traces, Webb has unveiled it in extraordinary detail. This is no blur or mere data point. It is a portrait rich with light, shape, and cosmic mystery. For astronomers, this image forms a bridge between stars. We are not merely tracking a passing rock. We are looking directly at a fragment of another world. The image shows an irregular glowing body wrapped in a faint, ghostly halo of reflected light, a whisper of its long journey through space. Webb's infrared vision reveals a surface etched with ridges, fractures, and scars, each a record of impacts and eons of cosmic wear. Unlike the smooth, relatively uniform Aluamua, 3E Atlas is rugged, ancient, and complex, shaped by both fire and ice across millions of years. Spectral data have detected frozen carbon, silicates, and organic molecules on its surface the raw ingredients of planets and perhaps the precursors of life itself. This suggests that the seeds of worlds are scattered far and wide across the galaxy. When the first image appeared on the monitors, silence filled the control room. Scientists realized they were observing matter that had originated from outside our solar system, a relic from another star system, now drifting silently through ours. 3E Atlas has traveled for millions of years, carving a path through interstellar darkness until fate placed it within Webb's gaze. Faint heat beneath its icy crust hints that it is not entirely inert. Perhaps warmed by radioactive decay or a slow, tumbling motion, it is not a dead fragment but a living relic, still evolving and still whispering its origin story. 3E Atlas was first spotted by the Atlas Survey in Hawaii designed to identify near-Earth asteroids. Once its hyperbolic trajectory was confirmed, astronomers knew it had come from beyond our Sun. Ground-based telescopes could only trace its motion and measure brightness, leaving its true nature a mystery. Webb's infrared mirrors, far from Earth's atmosphere, cut through darkness and dust, capturing the chemistry and surface details of this alien traveler. The data surprised researchers. Its composition suggests formation around a star quite unlike our Sun, likely a cool red dwarf. Humanity now holds a fragment of another solar system, a message carried across the Milky Way for millions of years. The object's reddish hue is caused by tholines, organic compounds formed through radiation processing, similar to those found on comets in our own outer solar system. These molecules are thought to be precursors to life, suggesting that the basic ingredients for biology can travel across interstellar space. Its uneven rotation indicates that 3E Atlas is a loosely bound cluster of rock and ice, a fragile rubble pile held together by gravity and the cold. Webb even detected faint jets of vapor emanating from its sunlit side, evidence that volatile ices remain trapped within. This activity forms a shimmering halo, giving the object a comet-like glow that defies the frozen emptiness around it. Each observation of 3E Atlas forces scientists to rethink how worlds form and drift between stars. The space between suns is not empty, it is a vast repository of wandering fragments, each carrying a record of its birthplace. When Webb's first image reached Earth, astronomers held their breath. What appeared on the screen was more than just data, it was a whisper across the void, a fragment of a solar system not our own. For generations, astronomers had dreamed of such a moment, a piece of another star system close enough to study in unprecedented detail. Now, that dream had materialized into a golden image. Researchers quickly realized that 3E Atlas is not merely a comet or asteroid. 
It is a survivor, a wanderer forged in the disk of another star. Its chemical signature hints at a system with cooler light, possibly a faint red dwarf long since faded. The ratios of carbon, oxygen, and nitrogen reveal a chemistry unlike any born beneath our sun, telling a story of distant stellar storms, collisions, and the violent processes that shaped it long before humanity existed. The surface itself is rough and ancient, a landscape of frozen ridges, fractured stone, and icy scars. Webb's instruments detected dust fused to the crust by radiation over millions of years. In false color imaging, the object glows with deep crimson and bronze tones, evidence of tholines and complex organics created by cosmic radiation. These molecules, once drifting through the young solar nebula, may have helped spark life on early Earth. For astrobiologists, this is profound. If such molecules can survive interstellar travel, the building blocks of life are not confined to a single system. They are cosmic nomads, carried from world to world by travelers like 3E Atlas. Its movement through space is both graceful and uneven, a slow tumble revealing its fragile nature. Webb's cameras even captured faint jets of vapor venting from the sun-facing side. Weak but persistent sunlight warms pockets of frozen gases, creating puffs that form a glowing veil around the object. This behavior astonished scientists, who had not expected an interstellar object drifting through the cold emptiness of space to remain active. Within its shell lies a trace of warmth, a memory of the star that once nurtured it. This faint activity transforms 3E Atlas from a relic into a living witness of cosmic history. The discovery reshapes our understanding of planetary formation and interstellar dynamics. If such wanderers are common, every solar system may send fragments outward, tiny ambassadors carrying dust, ice, and organic molecules. Over eons, these fragments mix and mingle, seeding other systems. The galaxy, in this sense, becomes a vast interconnected ecosystem, each star contributing to the evolution of countless others. 3E Atlas may have once belonged to a young planet shattered by collisions or ejected by gravitational chaos. Now, it sails through the void, carrying the story of its lost home. Every atom within it has journeyed farther than imagination can reach, yet through Webb's golden mirrors, these atoms now share their light with humanity. Each photon, emitted from a distant world, traversed billions of kilometers across empty space before being captured by a human-made telescope, a meeting of the natural and the artificial, of cosmic time and human curiosity. Webb's observation is more than a scientific triumph, it is a celebration of human wonder. It demonstrates how far our vision has extended, from early stargazers on Earth to a telescope orbiting far beyond the moon, observing a visitor from another star. Even as 3E Atlas drifts ever farther, its image remains a quiet symbol of connection. Exploration is never truly over, it simply moves from one horizon to the next. In the vastness between stars, every wandering fragment carries a story. By learning these stories, we begin to understand our own. We are composed of the same cosmic dust that drifts between suns, part of the same endless journey. Somewhere, in another sky, perhaps another observer is looking back, wondering about us, just as we now wonder about 3E Atlas. Through this interstellar wanderer, humanity glimpses not just the universe but its own place within it, a fleeting yet profound connection across the vastness of space.